Well, this is a conversation that needs to happen. It's a conversation about how Birmingham can learn from its past to create a new dynamic and inclusive future. It's a conversation about how everyone in this city is part of the narrative of this city. I'm delighted that Common Purpose has decided to initiate this series of conversations about how intergenerational leadership needs to be embedded at the heart of what this city does. What it means in practical terms is all sectors of the city, all communities getting involved, coming together in a way that they haven't done in the past to offer their contribution to create a dynamic and more inclusive city. A leader is often about his or her followers and if all parts of the city aren't included in the narrative of cities, then leaders aren't really leading. In terms of what leaders can practically do is to look at themselves, look at their own spheres of influence to see how far, how extensively diversity is implicated in what they do. Because we all know that Birmingham is a super diverse city and if that super diversity isn't reflected in the practices of city leaders, then it's really not living up to its ideals.